What is up everybody? It's Collect Empire underscore KM back with another video. And I did not expect to film this video, but I got off of work early. So I went searching. And what searching led to was getting some August 1st sets early. If you all pay attention to social media or other people posting in general, yes, I did indeed find these sets from Kohl's. And with that being said, let's see what I all got. So with the first set of what I got, I did pick up the Lamborghini Huracan Technica, if that's even how you say it. But I'm a big Technic fan, big car person. So I had to pick this up, especially since there was only two left. I cannot wait to pick one up for myself. This is just a great set. I love the vibrant color. This is a well-known Lamborghini color in general. So I'm glad to pick this up and see how it possibly scales or looks compared to the others. Now the next set I picked up, it may be overpriced, but in the end, I would say why I decided to get them from Kohl's anyways. But with that being said, I decided to pick up one of the only DC sets LEGO decided to release this year. And that is indeed the Batwing, Batman versus the Joker. The reason I struggle saying that is because I didn't know if it had a certain year or if it said 1989. But yeah, I decided to pick this one up. Fantastic set. I love just like Batman stuff in general. Although I do wish the LEGO would actually expand the universe and do other sets based on other characters such as Green Lantern, more Wonder Woman or just other oddball characters in general. But now let's move into the next one. Now the next one I picked up also follows the Batman theme and that is indeed the Batmobile. It's a fantastic set. I love the look of it. Yeah, overpriced once again. It probably should be more of the price range around where the Batwing is. But I do love my Batmobiles. And I recently just picked up the uh, UCS one, which was one of my first UCS sets ever. So it was nice to see the actual version basically in play scale form. So it would be cool seeing the scale, how it looks like. I'm more of a big, you know, big go home type of person. But you know, it probably is going to be nice and sleek, just the size it is in general. But let's get right into the next set. And now, I believe I will be getting to the LEGO Star Wars sets. And I, of course, made you guys wait to see them because save the best for last, right? <laughs> so with that being said, let's get right to the next so set. So with the first LEGO Star Wars set that I did pick up from Kohl's is the Yoda Starfighter. So the reason I picked up this one was because, for one... I'll get towards it in the end and say why I decided to get him from Kohl's. But I actually really like the back print on the R2. That would be my first with back printing. And I did not have the older Yoda Starfighter. So this would be nice, a nice addition to my Starfighter collection. So the next Star Wars set I picked up is the Spider Tank. Yes, it may be overpriced, but I really like the Bo Katan figure. I honestly like her way better than the Clone Wars one they came out with in the little uh Mandalorian Starfighter and then also you know you can never have enough nice Mandalorian figures basically because they're throwing them in every set and same goes for Grogu but I'm really excited to see what she looks like honestly I think she's one of the better figures of the year with the amount of detail and yeah the set was expensive but yeah I just had to pick it now I say what I think is the best just because the minifigure for last and with that being said, I picked up the Boba Fett mech. And the reason I decided to pick this up now is, of course, I could not wait for that figure. This figure has a bunch of detail. Yeah, I wish he came with a cape, but with that being said, I got a second one just to put a cape on one and then to leave the other just regular and how it looked like, you know, out of the box. But I'm really excited to see what he actually looks like in the arm detail since i do not have a ucs style boba fett and yeah it's been quite a long time since i got a regular boba fett so this will be fantastic that's going to wrap up today's video but before i wrap it up the reason i started getting from kohl's is that i was in there the whole time calculating on my phone exactly how much i would save if i were to get out of kohl's compared to lego and in the end, Kohl's was a better deal as you get $10 back for every $50 spent in Kohl's cash. So that's the reason I decided to pick all these up. 
at the time because they're there. I wish there's three 30 second battle packs, but I'll use the Coles Cash for either some of those or some other sets that I may see, up, see go up on sale on Coles. And yeah, with that being said, that's the reason I got from Coles is just a better deal. And honestly, the promo for August 1st, I feel like will not sell for a whole bunch. So in the end, it was way more beneficial to get them from Kohl's instead of Lego. But anyways, that's going to wrap up today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. See you in the next video and peace out and have a good time.